Forum for Democratic Change has joined the rest of Ugandans to mourn the death of the Speaker of Parliament, Right Honorable Jacob Olanya, who died on Sunday at 10.45 a.m. East African time in the state of Seattle in the United States of America. FDC President Patrick Amoria Toboy praised the late as a gifted politician whose oratory abilities were unmatched by very many politicians in the country. Whose respect for diverse political opinions was evident in the manner in which he gave equal opportunities to members of parliament on either side of the political divide. We remember Jacob as a competent lawyer and social worker who exuded benevolence and was always on the side of the law. According to Amoriat, the late's political career started at Macquarie University when he was elected Speaker of Students Guild in 1990 under the leadership of Honorable Nobat Mao, currently President General of the Democratic Party. Despite his contribution to nation building, Oboy said that it was regrettable that the late Speaker Jacob Olanya died from abroad while on treatment. That Right Honorable Olanya, like a number of prominent Ugandans, had to die while receiving treatment abroad, which continues to expose the poor health care facilities or systems in the country and necessitates the constant call on the NRM government to put more resources to the improvement of health facilities in the country. And FDC has postponed its mobilization activities in northern Uganda and will not discuss the issue of by-elections until the morning and burial for the late is done. The case is that if there is an election of the speaker, and this is what I would want to see as the chief executive, that we participate as the FDC. My appeal would have been, if it is not legally fatal that the NRM stops the process of election of speaker until such a time that the Honorable the Right Honorable Olanya, Jacob Lokori, is buried. I'm Navka Farida and Kenneth Tanaba at Najanankumbi.